Remember to bring a light sweater with you today. It is going to get quite chilly for the afternoon. I'm meteorologist Dr. Athena Masson. For our afternoon high temperatures, many of us only rising up into those mid, possibly even the upper 60s. This is all thanks to a cold front that moved through the area late last night. 67 for your high in Gainesville, 69 in Ocala. Very well could reach 71 to the south, Crystal River, and over towards the villages. For the evening, once again, keep that sweater close by. Our temperatures lowering down into the 50s before midnight. Mostly clear skies to start off the night. Starting to see some cloud cover building by the midnight hour. Partly cloudy skies for the overnight. Most of us should be waking up to mostly clear conditions, but our temperatures getting down into those upper 40s for Thursday morning. 48 for your low in Gainesville, 51 in Ocala, 55 out towards the villages. And to the north, don't be surprised, we could even see some upper 30s around the I-10 corridor. Live Oak at 42, Lake City at 43. For the end of the week, temperatures will be on the rise. So if you are not a fan of these temperatures, mainly in the 60s for the afternoon, we'll start to get back up into the 70s. By Thursday, cold front down towards South Florida, but just behind it, that's where this cooler, drier weather will be entering into our area. High pressure begins to move off into the Atlantic, but notice this as it continues to move away. Now we're getting more of an easterly flow, so those are warmer temperatures. We'll start to see our temperatures climb up on Friday and especially into the weekend, but we're also monitoring with that easterly flow. That's going to help to pick up some moisture from the Atlantic, push itself into the Florida Peninsula. We could get some isolated showers, but once again, very hit and miss. Most of them should be along the first coast and the space coast beginning Friday, lasting into Sunday. But it's all about those temperatures rising right back up into the lower 80s by Sunday, and that is once again just a little bit above average for this time of the year.